Our current study that we're doing is a uh, milk allergy desensitization study. Um, what this means is that we're taking a very small amount of milk uh, and giving it to children who are allergic. We're then very gradually increasing that amount um, until, they, until they reach a threshold level on the first day. And then over several weeks, we continue to increase the amount of milk that they're receiving. One of the things that's unique about our study is that we're using a medication called Zolair, uh, which is an antibody against the allergic antibody. And we're hoping that this will help to prevent uh, allergic reactions to the milk as we're doing the desensitization process. We also hope that by going over this sort of long period of gradually increasing the milk, that the immune system will develop the immune cells which will allow it to tolerate the milk. When a child is diagnosed with a food allergy, the family's lifestyle changes. Uh, they have to, to prepare their food differently. It affects their ability to go out and eat dinner, uh, and it affects their ability to go to social events. Sometimes patients will and families will become very anxious about exposure to the food uh, and about developing a, an allergic reaction. Food allergy has a major impact on quality of life for families, so I think that anything we can do to re reduce their food allergies would be really terrific. The ideal outcome is that the patient will be cured of their milk allergy and that they'll be able to have milk, you know, basically whenever they want it or they'll be able to have, you know, ice cream or, or other milk products.